Here we are again, and it's a tier 7 game and Ruinberg on fire. I'm on my T29, and this is a confrontation. This is actually the very first confrontation I ever got into, and I kind of like the result, so here it is. Um, so I literally start off um, by making a joke, of course, by saying US versus Germany, allons so Of course, you know, French. Uh, yeah, I like to think I'm funny. Then, as I'm driving down here, I'm of course checking with the enemy team, and I suddenly realize that there's three E25s, and they've all got clan war tags, which means that they're probably three very good players. Drive around. So I really start, as I drive down here, I really drive, type to my team, kill E25s. Because the faster that platoon is out of circulation, the better our chances for a win. Now, mind you, a tier 7 confrontation with the, for the Americans is usually pretty good news, because the T29 is so powerful at this tier. Uh, so there's a pretty good chance that we're going to win this one, just, just looking at the two team makeups. But the 25s are pretty ferocious and just could make up for it. And there they are. The whole platoon has literally lined up in a gun line around E6, 7, and 8. And you saw just how fast that Hellcat went down. Whoop, I take a bounce from a Panther. And this T29 is taking up sniping in the position right here. So I said to myself, you know what? They don't need me here. I'm going to go for those E25s. So the 25s aren't paying much attention down here yet, of course, they haven't realized that they're a target. Of course, that one did, and he just ate a, um, a big round to the face. Now, they don't do a lot of damage per shot, but they shoot very, very rapidly. As you can see, that was just one shooting at me. And damaging my tracks have done a little bit of actual damage to my tank, but now I'm pushing down this road, confident that they're, the knot of tanks in E3 will cover my rear. So I'm going to come forward and uh, try and help do flanking fire on the tanks coming up along um, the village. Alright, and in this corner right here, I can make preparations for my defense. And there they are, primary party target, E25. Oof, tough spot to shoot into, but, oh, oh, there he was. Boom! That was actually the second of the three E25s I just took a big chunk out of. And there goes the third one. That's one. That's the one I actually... Actually, no, I have already shot that one. There's another one right up there, though. Is it high health level? Whoop! When suddenly a Panther M10 shows up. Fortunately, I got some reinforcements in the form of a T21. Whoop! Something else is shooting at me from over there. I missed the Panther M10. Whatever it is, it's pretty persistent. Oh, it's an enemy Panther tank. Well, he's a concern, but there's an E25 up there. He needs to go. There we go. That was actually the third E25. I actually put one shot each into every single one of the E25s. Whoop. Well, he's going to get away from me. Oh, after this panther was annoying me earlier. There. I just did as much damage to him in one shot as he basically did to me with several shots earlier. As I'm staying in cover, wait to reload. Oop, he's smart enough to have run away. Alright. Now I have to decide what to do next. Well, what seems logical is to push this Panther M10. He's a tier 7 medium. I'm a tier 7 heavy. Whoop, VK, getting away. Give him a solid hit. He takes a chunk off of me. Scout tank is making a run for it. I go into side scrape position here to keep it myself from being damaged too much while I reload. That Panther tank is back, and bounces around off my turret, I give him a nice big hit. Bounces another round off my turret, or something. Whoop! Someone just hit me in the flank. Oh, it's that VK. That was almost very dangerous for me. Put another hit on him. So I'm just here thinking, hmm, I could be in a bit of trouble right here, so I angle a bit. <laughs> and a whole bunch of shots are just bouncing off of me. I don't know if that's good luck or what. Well, I still spot that there's another T-29 literally behind these guys. Yep. The other guys have pushed through the town and are actually surrounding these guys. So at this point, I say, heck with being patient. Going in. This point of the Panther 10 clearly does not understand how you don't shoot a T-29. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Failed to quickly finish him off right there. And that is actually the end of the game. That was my, my one and only kill. But still... 2,373 damage done. I feel like it was a good one. Good game. And good night.